The title of this video is still standing slash keep living because that's what I want to tell you. It has been 365 days since the enemy originally told me that I was going to die. So the fact that 365 days later, I'm still alive is the testimony that if you keep living, you will keep living. What I mean by that is if I had really gave into everything that the enemy has told me over the past year about my life, about uh, my fate, about my impending demise, everything that the enemy tried to show me, continues to try to show me, um, if I just were to give into that, I absolutely would be dead. But the fact that I'm still alive is the proof that if you keep living, you will keep living. Further into what I mean by that is that I believed that I was going to die. I didn't think that there was a way out of the grief and the pain and the brokenness but I live and I'm alive. Listening to this song by Marvin Sapp this morning that I love called Still Standing. And it's absolutely my testimony. Um, there, there's a part of the song that says, all of the pain I had to go through gave me power and a testimony. Listen, I'm not about to play these games on YouTube because I feel the tears trying to well up. And I didn't come here to preach. I really just came to say that a year later, a year after the enemy originally attempted to convince me that I was going to die, 365 full days later, I still got the nerves to be alive. I say the same thing to you. That might not make you run. That might, make, might not make you shout. That might not make you go shaky, shaky right now, but you make it through this. And you look back over what, however long you've been going through, whatever it is that you're going through, and you'll be able to see that it, it was nothing but the grace and mercy of God that kept you. And you will be grateful for the fact that he didn't allow you to die. Because even your decision to not die is his grace and his mercy. I encourage you in that today. And again, I know that this video might not take away the pain or immediately remove the frustrations of whatever things that are coming against you right now, but just let the fact that I'm breathing be testimony that if you keep living, you will keep living. That is brilliant and profound to somebody that thought they were gonna die. And if you just keep living, you will keep living. I pray specifically that God will give you grace to trust him more and that a year from now, you'll be able to look back at today and say, I'm still standing.